Lately I've been thinking about the choices I have made and doubt the life I've chosen for myself I wonder how it would pan out if I stuck to the status quo and stayed in England never know But when I see my friends I see them with this golden glow It seems they can touch the rainbow I guess I'll never know, never know, never know I must look horrible right now Okay, so for the past um, two months maybe, I've been getting up at this time and I start my day off by doing the Bible in a year, which I've spoken about before. So I'm really sorry if my voice is so low. It's so early, I don't really feel like speaking up. My baby. Hi, my name is Father Mike Schmitz, and you're listening to the Bible in a Year podcast, where we encounter God's voice and live life through the lens of Scripture. The Bible in a Year podcast is brought to you by Ascension. Using the Great Adventure Bible timeline, we'll read all the way from Genesis to Revelation, discovering how the story of salvation unfolds and how we fit into that story today. It is day 274. I, in my city. I am feeling much more awake now, so usually in the mornings after I pray, I get changed to work out and now I'm gonna go work out with my friends via Zoom. Okay, this is what my setup usually looks like. So I broadcast YouTube from my iPad so I can watch it on the TV. And then um, that's Action Jacqueline over there. You must know her if you work out online. Uh, and then I work out over here. That way I can do the workout at the same time my friends are doing the workout. Oh, I just got I just got a message that this isn't the right video. Hang on. So what am I doing today instead? Boop. Often we're reminded to enjoy each day and find it in ourselves to show some gratitude for every moment through and through. I try so hard to just be present, mom will slip the other lessons. I can't help but wonder, but I guess I'll never know it. What the other book looks like. Oh, wouldn't that be nice? Okay, workout done. Now it's time to get some coffee. If I'd stay. In my city Red, blue, and green Is that how my life would be? Is that how my life would be? Hi, so my hair is still a little bit of a mess, but whatever. Um, somebody was asking me about a skincare routine, so I thought I'd just do that now so first oh this is kind of dirty <laughs> first eye cream i i'm using infrastrite infrasite eye refining matrix this was recommended by my dermatologist so i am checking it out i like it because it is a retinol which should help with um the wrinkles under your eyes mm -hmm. tap it in be very gentle Whatever is left on my fingers, I take down the smile lines and then a little bit of my neck. These are all sensitive areas, like thin areas of skin, so you don't want to pull. So I'm just like tap, tap, tap. And then I have been using the It Skin Hydrating GF Genuflector or the serum i suppose um i was shopping for makeup remover and i saw this and i was tempted to buy it because my skin's been feeling kind of dry so i decided to try it out put a little on my hands tap tap i don't like that it's fragrance like i can smell the perfume on it but 
I mean, I have no complaints about it. And I guess my skin has been feeling a little bit more hydrated. It isn't as um, patchy. Sometimes I get dry patches on my cheeks and on my chin here. But I haven't been getting that, so I guess it's working. For my moisturizer, I actually use the CeraVe moisturizing cream, which I repot into like a little travel pot like this. So it looks more like a face cream and not like body lotion. Um, I use this because it's nice and hydrating and it's non-comedogenic. It has ceramides in it. You know, all the good stuff. Always, always take your skincare down your neck. At night, it's pretty much the same thing. The only difference is I put this on first. This is different. Adapalene, which I got from my dermatologist as well. It's It helped immensely with my acne. So um, I've been using it regularly for a couple of years now and I really like it. So I use that maybe every other night. And then aside from that, the skincare routine stays pretty much the same for everything else. So yesterday I finally finished this piece um you might have seen the video where i did the first half here but i never finished the other half of the page and what amazed me was how much faster it was for me to finish this half versus this half like this half of the page took me maybe two days to complete and then this one only took me like half a day and drawing my first chrysanthemum over here versus drawing the last one that I did, which I think was this one, or it might have been this one. This was so much easier and faster for me than doing this. So it just goes to show that the more you do something, of course, practice just makes life a little bit easier. Daddy? Daddy? The puppy strong! Yeah! <laughs> Yeah, but let's not cut it because I don't know. Nice your bun. I think if you iron it, it'll be fine. It's bunching up a bit here. Off. I know it's fine now. Because I did this. Yeah, it's because you were twerking. Samuka. <laughs> oh, can I let me wear? Why is it nice? Because <laughs> I don't want to screw up the second one. No, you know. Yay. I forgot to turn on the camera, so we're trying to fix her dress. And then the first one is a success, but this was the easier one. Which yeah. That's why we started with that. This one, are you really gonna remove all of the sequins? No. No, I knew it. Kapuya. Kapuya's alive. Okay, I'm gonna change out of this. <clears throat> Scotty woke up, so Chris went to take care of him. I'm about to sew this back onto the collar. So what we needed to do was shorten the torso. I don't even know if you can see me from this angle. Um, we needed to shorten the torso here so it wasn't sagging so much. So what I did was I ripped open a hole here in the collar and we're gonna stuff in the extra fabric. Um, but I read online that if you're sewing through beads or sequins or things like that, you should wear safety goggles because there's a tendency that your needle might break and you know, hit you in the eye. But I don't have safety goggles, so I'm going to use a face mask. Oh, I moved the camera. Here goes nothing. Hey, nothing broke. Bet there's seamstresses out there thinking this is completely unnecessary and you're such a weirdo, but whatever. Okay, what I did was I... Um, let me take this off and then now I'm gonna cut off a little bit of the top so that it will fit better in the collar which is incredibly nerve-wracking I really don't mind doing this for other people you know I like being able to help I just really don't want to screw it up as well someone's coming
Da -da 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 -da. Okay. Yeah. Cause I Do. <gasps> Strawberry. Oh, it looks so yummy. Can I have? Can I have strawberry, please? Oh my gosh, cute okay, hung face. He's just smiling like, no, these are my berries. I love you. Can you have mommy and Lily Pot? Berries. Berry. You walk around there. Can Dido have berries, please? Dick, dick. Here. Dilly. Big, big berry. Can you almost spray alcohol, ni? Ah, yes. What can you play with here, Mandido? Mm, just like, look at look at all those books. Those are all kids' books. Oh yeah. Next, Scotty. Oh there, that looks decent. Next, Scotty. Nice. Good job. Well, let's see. Let's you cut see. it now. You haven't tried it. Yeah, I cut off that much. Nice. Long. So kaigo rigid siya here. So let's try. Sastri na din Oh my gosh, new profession. Let's have a picnic. I'll pack a lunch. One day, let's go to New Zealand. <laughs> yeah. Then you, that with Hong Kong, huh? Hong Kong will go to New Zealand with us. Uh, it's not <laughs> the best job. What? I'm gonna look at some front. But anyway, since I have it, do you want to try it on first? Ah! Yeah, it's weird. It's freaking you wait! <laughs> it's so bad! It's so weird! I'm bad at making things straight, okay? And dude, this is open! I missed it. Berry. Okay, okay. Give berry back. They don't get berry. They don't get berry. No. What? Yes. You don't eat berry. You don't give you eat berry for me, Nalang. Oh, good night, Joe. Good night, Auntie. Just kidding for Scotty. Ah, ah, ah. Oh, no. Daddy, <laughs> you're wearing to the wedding? Yeah, but the wedding's just in my back in law's backyard. Yeah, family, Raman. Oh. The, the October 10th. The stitched option. Look, I'll show you. How do you. Okay, I'll go back. Ta da! Is it Huey? Is it? No, it's fine. Yeah, dude, I made that whole dress. By myself. With all the beading. <laughs> Grabbing, no? Just this week. Aren't you impressed? Today, you're gonna get the hate. <laughs> the face of someone who does not believe. <laughs> Chris has gone home, and it is time for the second workout of the day. So I'm wearing the same workout outfit because I didn't really sweat that much this morning. I don't know if that's gross or not, if that's TMI, but. It's just how it is. Today I am doing shoulders, weights for shoulders and lift intervals. So slight hit workout. Cause I am old, I gotta wear these things now when I do any type of like jumping exercise. Dun -dun -dun, so glamorous. I don't even know if you can see that. I'm not afraid to 